from beautiful Hawaii, the opening ceremonies of the Fox Summer Games. to the 1992 Fox Summer Games. Oh, they love Super Dave. Just be patient. He'll be along in just a few moments. Believe me, this is going to be a very exciting week here in Honolulu, Hawaii. The Fox Network has spared no cost to bring you some of the most exciting events and some of the most fantastic shows you will ever see. Everything will have a fun in the sun theme. So, for those of you who want an alternative to the cold of winter, stay tuned this week to the Fox Summer Games. And now, in just a few seconds, the host of the Fox Summer Games, the greatest daredevil superstar entertainer of our time, the great Super Dave Osborne, will be coming in here on his atomic-powered rollerblades to officially open the games. And, here, there he is. He's coming right now. Ladies and gentlemen, Super Dave Osborne! How you doing? Seriously injured. Give him a hand. Hurry, hurry. Super. Super. Super, quick, tell us, are you all right? Well, yes, I'm fine. Thank you very much. I'm okay, Michael. There was a slight wind. I didn't judge for it, so I went by a little, but I broke the fall with my face, and I'm just terrific. And... I'm just thrilled to be here tonight. That's all I can tell you. Well, it's going to be a very big week, and tell us what's coming up. Well, Michael, it's a very huge week here in Honolulu, Hawaii. The Fox Network is bringing you the fantastic Fox Summer Games. I'm very honored to be the host of the games, and I'll be here all week. I'll be doing some great stunts. It's going to be fantastic. And, of course, Fujihaki Ito will be here to help me coordinate things. Well, uh, Super, what are you going to be doing tonight? Well, Michael, I'll be doing a couple of things. One, I will be computer training Evander Holyfield, the heavyweight champion, mm -hmm. Preparing him, it's going to be absolutely sensational. We're going to tape it and show it to you later on. And there will be a lot of other surprises. Right now, I want to open the first Summer Games with a terrific movie, one of my favorites, Weekend at Barney's. Weekend at Barney's. That too. <laughs> minutes ago and there was a slight mishap but fortunately we had the videotape running so we can show it to you right now keep it going all right all right back off back off that's enough look at this Jack Dempsey. look at this oh. you're going you're going now keep it going keep the energy up all right this is a special computer it's a life-size it's a punch matic the only thing I want here is one right hand go down deliver a right go ahead you got one shot and go for it down and go for it. Oh, I love it. I love it. Beautiful. Look at this. Rocky Marciano. Rocky Marciano and me. Yo, all right, now, let's keep it up. Keep the energy up. Now you're going. This is block a punch, all right? You're going to bob. You're going to weave. One punch is going to be thrown. Oh. How many times do I have to apologize to this man? First of all, you were an hour late. Then you welcome him as the great heavyweight champion, George Foreman. Then you take off your hat, and you have that stupid Don King wig on. And now, I don't know how much this costs. You've put two right gloves. Look at this. Don't worry. It won't work. It's not going to work. It won't work. Fortunately, Fuji had a hospital tent erected very close to the stunt area, so Super Dave is getting immediate care. We'll check back with the Super One right after the conclusion of Weekend at Bernie's. I get proper rest. I should be okay by Thursday, and that's what I'm pointing for. Uh, you know, with the Simpsons, Drexel's class, and 90210, just to be a part of that schedule is a dream of mine. And I want to say one more thing. If not for the brilliance of Fujiaki Ito and having the emergency hospital tent ready, I don't know if I would have made it because the doctor said we didn't have time to take an ambulance. Well, beautifully put as always, Super. Please try to get some rest. Yeah, good night, everybody. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. An emotional and gut-wrenching opening day. Anyway, see you Thursday night for day two of the Fox Summer Games, starring the one and the only Super Dave Osborne. Good night, everybody. Are we off? Good. Hey, Fooch, this is magnificent. Where are we?
Believe it or not, it says here we're not far from where the Moanaloa Highway used to be. What if it's still being used? I don't think so. to conclude with a cycling world record by Super Dave Osborne. Uh, Super, we have a couple of minutes left. How do you feel? Well, Michael, the headwinds held me up a little bit, and I won't be able to break the record live on the Fox Summer Games tonight. Maybe we could show a tape tomorrow night. I can't talk to you anymore. i got to concentrate. Something could happen if I don't. Break the record. Break the record. Break the record. Break the record. The record's broken. <laughs> I think the truck raised the super one. What a shame. He was so close to breaking the record. Well, I'm sure that Super Dave will be back tomorrow night to try another sensational stunt. See you tomorrow. Tonight is a big night for Fox. America's most wanted. A special episode of 90210. I'll also be showing you my all-new fast food restaurant where all the participants have been eating. And also no matter what you order, if you don't get served within 60 seconds at the drive-thru, you get a free Super Dave Cola. Well, he and Fuji had trouble communicating. Fortunately, we have it on tape, and we can show it to you now. But first, if there are any young children in the room, you might want to send them to bed because this is pretty harrowing stuff. Okay, are we ready to roll the tape? Roll it. When I get the order and I give you the signal, you time it, all right? All right. And if it's more than 60 seconds, I'll give Fuji a drink. Okay, okay gang, come here, quickly. Boy, am I having a good time. Is this fun or what? All right. Welcome to Super Day Fast Food Drive Through. May I help you? Yes, please. Thank you very much. You're welcome. I would like five super burgers. Five SBs. Five super fries. Five SFs. Three super pizza. Three super peas. Everything on it? Yes, please. Oh, yes, oh. yes. Okay, go ahead. Two super malt. Two super malt. Thick? Very thick. Great, go ahead. Five super salad. Five SSs. Five super colas. Five super colas. You want the special dressing on the salads? Yes, please. All right, SD special. That is it. That'll do it. Thank you. All right. All right, you got this? We got five super burgers, five SFs, three super pizzas loaded, five super malt stick, five super salads, super day special dressing, and five super colas. Are you ready? It's a challenge, gang. Let's go. Michael, start. Go. Forty-five seconds. Are those the burgers? Yeah. Fries? Fries. Thirty Pizzas. seconds. We got the malts. Salads. Salads. Come with a cold. Fifteen seconds. Thank you very much. And now, Mr. Hakeido, you can drive through and get your order with ten seconds to spare. All right, thank you. Folks, we really don't know how Super Dave is because he's back in the hospital as I speak. But needless to say, this has been a very, very tough week for him. First, he had the accident with Evander Holyfield. And then he was hit by a semi. On Thursday night, he had a golfing accident. And, of course, he was smashed on his bicycle. So what was supposed to be just a lot of fun in the summer games has really turned into a bit of a tragic vacation, I would have to say. Hopefully, Super Dave is all right, and we want to get a further update from him later on. But right now, let's go to Beverly Hills 90210. You must stay in bed. I can't. Send an express elevator for Super Dave right now. I can't. Oh, it's really late. Great. What is your Elevator is still great, Michael. It's been a rough week, but fortunately, I haven't been seriously injured. And tonight is really special. I'll be doing my 40-foot slam dunk attempt, hat to the ceiling of the gym, down dunk, land on my hands. It's going to be great. And let me take a moment to say to my friends at Showtime, I just don't have the time to plug the fact that my fifth year starts on March 13th. Oh, well, I'm sure they'll understand. Oh, and by the way, Super, yesterday morning you were testing your Geiger car. How did that go? Well, uh, the Hawaiian Ecological Society, along with the Fox Summer Games Committee, contacted me, Michael, and said they don't like oil wells over here. Could I develop something that would get rid of oil wells? And uh, Donald Glansman, my assistant, developed a Geiger car, goes along the earth, and you can tell 
from a computer in the car to a computer over on the edge what goes on underneath the ground. And mm. we were testing it. We had a slight mishap. We're going to show the tape. Maybe we'll redo it later. Oh, we've got it on tape. We've got it all queued up, ready to go. Well, it was a slight mishap, and I don't think they want to see it. Oh, I'm sure everybody... Wouldn't you like to? Sure they would. Okay, let's roll the tape. Okay, basically, I'm not getting too much of a reading here. Are you getting anything? No, not yet. All right, let's move okay. on a little bit. Moving on. Okay, I don't see too much going on here. Basically, I've got no oil anywhere in this area. Is that correct? That's what I'm getting on the readout, yeah. Okay, you've got 200. You should have white to light brown massive sandstone. Yeah, I'm getting, uh, I'm getting the sandstone. I'm getting a, a mineral deposit of some kind here. All right, bring it up more to the surface, please. Okay, going up to the surface. 180, you should have some Oxnard Aquifier in there. The, I'm getting Aquifier showing up. I'm getting... Uh, I'm getting another readout, a little less than uh, 180 feet. Let me feet. bring it right up to the surface, please. Okay, we're going right and up I'm now. I'm getting some kind of an iron ore deposit. I'm getting the same thing. Uh, give me a second, Super. It's coming out. We're getting a readout now. Is it a metal or something? Yeah. Oh, I know what it is. What is it? Train tracks. Train tracks? Double check that. I'm going to back up. was tough. Well, it was, Michael, but it's going to work. Uh, we just have to coordinate more with the boot. Look, we don't know how serious it is, but we hope to have a tape of the accident right after Cox. Okay. All right. If you Perfect. Back over there, Fuge. All right. So we're all clear. I'm going to count down five, four, three, two, one. I'm going to slowly raise up and lock in. Then I'm going to count down five, four, three, two, one. You're going to shoot me. Hat's going to hit the ceiling. Hold my breath, down, ball, dunk, land, and bow. Okay, here we go, first countdown. Five, four, three, two, one, go. All right, we're stopping, no we're not. Wasn't the worst of it. Super tried to fix the backboard, and this is what happened. What happened was, I didn't check this whole thing, and uh, Quasimodo had hooked up the uh, whole gym equipment to this one board where he has the backboard release and the lights and the rocket thing that he developed. And I see now that the wrong button was pushed. See you from the hospital right after the Fox Summer Games special. Team Liechtenstein wins their 18th gold medal. It's always interesting to see them win over and over again. I don't think so. to take a break from winter. Hi, I'm Jim Palmer. Now tonight, we're gonna take you on a summer vacation right when you need it most. We've got America's favorite summer pastime and my claim to the Hall of Fame, baseball. And for the first time,